Yo, 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 this is King Erna coming to you guys live and direct. First and foremost, make sure you hit that link that will be in the comments. It will be an honorable link for you to grab this raw lifestyle clothing. I want y'all to understand the fit is of it. The warmth is of it. And, you know, we restoring honor, man. I want to speak on this boy, Charlie, or whoever this cunt is that's really going crazy. Now, don't get me wrong. When it comes down to my city, I only honor those of honor. You've heard me at a time or another say little remarks about different individuals. But guess what? That has nothing to do with me standing with individuals that are of honor. Now, I don't know about them kittens online. I'm not standing with them on nothing. But I stand with Gilly and Wallow no matter what type of differences of the message because at the end of the day, what we must understand, this is what we must understand. We must understand that they have their angle, I have my angle. But this guy, Charles, he's going in too hard. He's looking for a view. He wants to clout. And then I seen where Say Cheese TV said, give him the interview. We don't give interviews or acknowledgement to these type of guys because at the end of the day, he don't know what he's speaking of. He don't know what he's talking about. Listen, Pop Hunter may have been a kid in the streets. It wasn't that that made me snatch his honor. You know what I snatched his honor for? The fact that when someone asked him about it, he said, "That's that was my dad. That wasn't me. So I honor little Uzi saying what he's saying. I honor Gilly saying what he's saying. At the end of the day, why is everybody upset at everybody's opinion in a situation where the individual did tell? Listen, we understand civilians tell, and we, we, we say we close the eye on it. But we must give an understanding to the people, man. And the understanding, we don't want no woolly, no woolly mutts in our joint. We don't want them there. Why? Who was Willie? William O'Neill the Rat, a part of the Black Panthers. And you've seen Farrakhan speak on that. Farrakhan spoke on it clearly. Y'all want to take one part of the message and say, ah, oh, we rocking with him. But when he speak about these informants, you know, an informant don't have to be a guy from the streets. They can wire up your next door neighbor and he can give up every information on you. We got to give an understanding of who these guys truly are. And guess what I'm going to do? continue to restore the honor and i got some big honor i want to snatch mafioso type that's coming next this mafia member was a boss a boss and this mafia member allowed federal agents to do a lot of things of dishonor when it came down to a black man by the name of who frank mathis and you know we're gonna start restoring the honor we're gonna get back to what we need to get back to man we ain't paying attention to no more kitten shows, none of that. We not acknowledging no rats because I may be the only man on the social media that come forth about something that he done at a time that was dishonorable before he even restored honor. So let's start getting back to what we need to get back to. If a lot of people notice, I don't rant and rave anymore. The reason why I don't rant and rave is because I shook the abuse of many drugs, went to a great depression when I was doing the dishonorable things that I was doing in life. And I turned to drugs, telling you youngins, listen to me, you can beat it. You can beat it. I'm gonna do a joint today where we're gonna be on Patreon and I'm gonna show you and I'm gonna give you knowledge of how to beat it without having to use other serious narcotics as an alternative without even having to experience a withdrawal. But some people better get an understanding. Some people need to go through a withdrawal. You know why? That's the worst pain in the world, man. And although I wasn't on heroin, I understand the understanding of all drugs and their withdrawal. We got to start giving the youngest back what's needed. You know, I got a little thrown off by stooping to community levels of rats when actually we know they're around it's always the big rats the number one rats the individuals that the youngest look up to that we should expose and i'm going to do that but i want people to really tune into the campaign 
make sure you tune into Raw Lifestyle Clothing. This clothing is the best clothing out. And guess what? We got hoodies. We're going to have the Code of Honor hoodies. All of these things going to be under Raw Lifestyle. So if you're carrying it correctly, support the movement, man. Support it. Make sure y'all tune all the way in. I'm King Erna. No one can snatch my honor. You know why? I'm one individual that's not going to hide any wrong. And guess what? When you're not a rapist, a pedophile, pervert, an individual running around doing stuff to people, you know, that's of dishonor, that, you know, something that God has to, like, let the people know that he forgave you, like, on a day of judgment. Other than that, man, you, you know, what are you going to do? Where are you going to go? When it comes down to honor, you're going to come here. Because at the end of the day, the honor I restore does not have a mimic. You never seen me go after clout. The goal was to expose any rat, any rat. And I showed y'all that I've done that on a community level. These guys see me. They smile, actually, and say, what's up? That's the ones I know that that too somehow, or they might be the rat. Because a lot of them guys, I don't know how they look. And I didn't care about that. I'm not running. I don't duck. I don't hide. I carry it with pure honor. This is not things that I do. I don't beef with individuals on Instagram. And I don't go through things. And I don't set up dates. I accepted the dishonor of a cunt, right? Playing, he was doing a ploy. I guess it was a white flag. But at the end of the day, some people are really upset at King Gurner. Some people think that I was speaking of the dead. And that's going to be in another video because King Gurner don't have a reason to speak of the dead in a negative form. But I will give examples of things that I feel like individuals should be tuning in doing instead of claiming to snatch the honor of a man who restored it. That's like you saying you're going to snatch Minister Farrakhan honor or his respect. You can't do it. No matter what he has seemed to do, no matter how much as a Muslim that follow Quran and Sunnah according to the Salafi Dawah, it's like that respect is there, but I'm not following the religion aspect of it. I'm following the understanding of who my people love and who my people follow. Like y'all talk bad about Umar Johnson. And that's going to be another video also. You can't talk bad about these individuals because guess what these individuals have one way or another done what i have done in a whole bigger broader fashion who has given out money to the children who has given a community service to the schools then created a workshop that i bought to youtube i'm thankful for all of this but now the bag has put me in a position alhamdulillah to live different now that I'm living different, I'm going in a different direction. And that direction is not following anything by my anger. Do you get what I'm saying, youngins? Don't let nothing bring you out. Your anger should not allow you to respond to guys online. Your anger should not allow you to get in a position where you feel as though you should shark and hunt people. We're not hunters. If you're a hunter, you should be looking for deer or bear to bring home to your family. And I want to say to the people who don't honor that, I'm just giving a parable, an example. I give them a lot because I've seen the great men of honor in this world at a time. Before we was here, they restored it with an honorable parable. So make sure y'all click the link for the raw lifestyle clothing. If you live a raw lifestyle, and I'm not talking about raw, raw. I'm talking about raw of you having some honor, some strength, you being ready alert for war because you have to be if you're a man of honor you have to be ready and able for war you have to be the coins got to be up and you got to be able to understand life and i ain't talking about a war of negativity i'm speaking about a war that we're going through period that a lot of us don't see things we put in our system we're going to be giving back everyone there's 60 of them it's 60 individuals who didn't get their cmos 
I would say, no, that's not okay. But I would say out of thousands of individuals, tens and twenties of thousands of people, 60 ain't bad. And I'm going to restore that honor, man. The load is dropping. Make sure y'all tune all the way in. Make sure y'all understand that that guy that's speaking against Wallow and Gilly the Kid, he don't understand right now at the end of the day they're doing something good. They, all, they both were in the streets at a time and could be doing something negative regardless. And the way he's prom promoting the incoming is like he's tough like that. And I don't believe him. I don't care what state he's from. And I love Texas, but guess what? There's no one coming to Philadelphia or going to do anything to anybody in Philadelphia in a negative manner. I don't care if it's my worst enemy. If it's not a rat or a rat lover, I'm coming with my honor intact to defend my people. Make sure y'all tune all the way in. Make sure y'all understand that Philadelphia is indeed, is indeed city of brotherly love. We're going to restore the honor. Go get that definition of sturdy by Leak Moss. Download that now. If you want to see something positive out of it, go download the joint with him and China Mac. It's of it. And then you go ahead and go, and if you want some understanding of the streets, get the joint with him and shoot him, man. Honor and tech. These two bulls with their honor and tech on a track like this. Oh, man, you know how we can. Ab is in a better place. He's healthy. Free Ab. Free, free the men. Free those of honor and those who stand on sturdiness. King Erna, live and direct. Don't forget, the link will be in the comments. Pinned. Oh, damn. God damn it, man. I think I want to snatch some honor here, Charlie. You don't know what happened with this kid. People are saying he was in the streets. But that's not what I'm here for. Because it seems a little young. And he seems as if he's into doing positive things. So I don't know. I, I don't know what he is. But I will say this, for him to point that finger and say it's his father is a dishonor. So I snatched his honor and I'm going to throw yours out of the window as I wing it around like that. You didn't hit your head all up against the lights. You cunt, you. Huh. King Erna, live and direct. You can't get it back, man. You talk too heavy online and we don't do that, man. If you're serious, just pull up, man. Don't say pull up, Neva. Like, pull up. And you got your camera out. You want to record it to prove to the people. You're taking pictures. Places where, yeah, pulled up. No, 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 no. That's not solid. That's getting recordings of what you're doing. We don't carry it like that here. At least those of honor don't. Live and direct.